Hey everybody, it's Kim, and uh, I have a DIY art bin share. I'm trying this ring light thing. I thought, oh, that'll make it better. Nope. I'll just go like this. <laughs> My glasses glare. I don't know. I keep trying to improve. I remembered my mic this time, so hopefully you can all hear me. Um, anyway, I got some really fun dies from them, and I did a few projects, or did two, and Margaret did one for me. I'll start with hers. We were crafting together, I think it was last weekend. Where is the die, though? Oh, here it is. Okay. And she came up, I was like looking at this going, I don't understand it. I don't get it. What is it? I got the table and all of that, but I didn't get the vines and stuff. And where, when I'm out at my trailer, I can't be using data. So anyway, we couldn't look it up on, on the web. So, but look what, she's such an artist though. She has the, look at that cup and the detail and the shadowing she does. Just beautiful just because but here's the table she inked this up and added um, some depth and there's the flowers she added this at the top isn't that gorgeous so i'm giving this back to her but i wanted to make sure i got a chance to share it her beautiful work so that is the table and like she said she goes this was not in her wheelhouse of normal things to do and she ended up loving it so that was fun i did get the boot this die here and it has a lot of little parts <laughs> so what i do is um sharon and craft eccentricity does this too she's kind of tipped me off to this um of color printing it out on or cutting it out rather sorry and i've just been doing it on smooth this is the bristol um cardstock smooth surface and then i color it in some of it i cut i ended up once i figure it out i'm kind of like okay i want this to be this color blah blah, blah. So, with all those parts and that said, this is my little, little guy. So it took me a while to figure out what this was. I drew the faces on, not perfectly. Um, but yeah, and the little, there's little slits in the stocking, t or the boot, like what is that, a sock maybe? So the little snowman poking out, peeking out. There's snow that comes with it. This little girl sitting, peeking out of the window, waving hello. Just adorable. And then I added white here and here with a gel pen and some little tips here and there just to um, make it more interesting. I thought this was like a light Christmas light. It was a little bush, so I changed it that way. I just added the crisscross with black and white marker. So yeah, I was really happy with how that came out. Very detailed, um, but yeah, very fun too. So I liked it. So there's that one. They also gave me a, I was going to say snowman, not snowman, ghosts. These little ghosts that have faces, adorable. And they come with all these little parts that I'll show you in a minute cut out. Little hat. The little pops, lollipop. Eyes if you want to. Things for the hat. This goes on the lollipop as well. Just to give it dimension. You get more eyes and a pumpkin for the um, one of the ghosts to carry. So I use this as my slim die uh, slim line card so I did a card front and this is what I came up with so I did them in variety of colors and I had this in my stash and this in my stash are you proud of me losing my stash I'm almost I'm getting there with the room I have been working on it before work I've been getting up at like 5 45 5 30 <laughs> yeah anyway so I did this just contrast. I thought that turned out really cute that way. And then the orange and the black trim. There's this little doodad. Aren't they cute? So I just colored in their eyes and used um, Signo pen for the white. And the cheeks as well. And I colored the watercolored the hats and those things. So I was really happy with how that came out. That was fun. I'm thinking I, maybe I should go back and do wobbles behind them 
so they'll have movement. Instead, I just put dimension. So there's that set. They also sent me, and I'll leave links below, this bird. You can see flying by to say hello, flying by to see how you are, that sort of thing. So I think they're herons. Don't think they are flamingos, they're herons. So they have different feet. Really cool. Big flock of birds. Okay, and I think there's something else. Sorry guys, I'm kind of disoriented. I don't get off this year till a little after four. It's, I used to get off at 3.15, so. I'm kind of whiny. <laughs> It's, it's so hard to go from doing nothing, basically, over summer, doing whatever you want, I should say, to, here it is, going wackadoo with work. So, and here are wings. I don't believe they, I think they're a separate piece. I, they're not meant to go with the birds. The birds already have their own darn wings. They can't, they don't need to share these. But anyway, for angels or maybe a sympathy card. So I'll color those, cut those out and color them up. And then this one, I'm real excited. I think this is the next one I'll do, is the snowman. He's kind of like half melted. So kind of a primitive snowman. So that's probably the next one that I will work on. So I wanted to share that. That's DIY Art Bin, and I will leave the links below. All right, guys, take care. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.